If you haven't heard, Papa John's is now accepting cafe cash. Reporter Larry Parks found out how this came about. The phones are constantly ringing. Drivers are running in and out of the restaurant and doors being flipped and baked at record speeds. That's an average day in Papa John's since they began accepting cafe cash. We have seen a major increase in sales since we started it, since we rolled out the cafe cash program last Wednesday. We've seen a major sales increase. Along with accepting cafe cash, Papa John's also runs the Woo Special. We've been doing the uh, Woo Special for five years now. Um, it's always been, the, it started out as the large one topping for $6.99. It went up to $7.99 recently. Students were surprised by the cafe cash deal because of Winter's distance from the shop. I thought McDonald's would have the cafe cash before anyone else since they were right down the street from the school. Thank you, Mr. Parks. Enjoy your pizza today. Thank you. Papa John's is on East Main Street, which isn't too far from Winter University. But why aren't the closer restaurants doing the same thing? One of the closer restaurants is Substation 2, and they tried to do the same as Papa John's 15 years ago. What doesn't surprise me about the Papa John's being the first one is I believe ARA is already a franchisee of Papa John's, which is why you have the uh, restaurants on campus you do. Local merchants aren't discouraged by Papa John's being the first. They just see a door opening for them in the future. Uh, the stores in close proximity to Winthrop, it would be very beneficial for them to get on the Cafe Cash program. Um, honestly, I hope not. That will keep the guys coming here, but you know, if they do, it would be really smart. Restaurants such as Substation 2 are hoping that the new College Town project will be their chance to get on board with Winthrop. With photographer Paisley Moore, I'm Larry Parks reporting for Winthrop Close Up. Cafe cash is accepted by carryout and delivery, but Papa John's does encourage students to tip the deliverer with real dollars for their services.